I'm Dr. Craig Pullman, and in this segment of the Mind Matters Show, my colleague Linnea Byer and I discuss a really funny movie about innovative teaching and the importance of music in education. Uh, the School of Rock, 2003. Yeah. What do you think of that movie? I love that movie. It's by Richard Linklater, who also directed uh, Through Skin or Darkly. He's done some out there stuff. And Slacker, and so he does, you know, some lighter fare like this, and then he does some serious fare, but... Jack Black's best movie. Not arguably, it's his best movie. He's Dewey Finn. Yes. He, he's a, a substitute te teacher, but he takes on the identity of his roommate. Yes. To be to get some cash. Yeah. Why and not? I think in Dead Poet Society, Robin Williams pretty much stays the same and he changes the kids. Yeah. It's kind of the reverse in School of Rock, where yes. the kid well the kids do change. Everybody changes. Everybody so changes in arc. school. Yes. Yeah. So he the, kind of similar movies in that they're both teachers that are going into kind of stuffy schools and just knocking the socks off everybody. And both of them have their own agenda at the beginning. I think Dewey more so, but he's really trying to put himself on the kids, you know, and get what he wants out of them. Like he's learning, or the kids are learning his songs at the beginning. And then towards the end, it's not just the kids that have learned something, but him. A great finale, one of the best musical finales ever. Yes. And one of the things I like about School of Rock is it, it, it talks about, in a funny way, how important arts are in an education. That music has an important place. We shouldn't just be cutting it, slashing it from budgets, and just teaching the test. Well, music in particular is based on math. So mm -hmm. it's it's intertwined. How you could say it's diff different from basic education is kind of ridiculous. It helps kids learn math, and math helps kids become better musicians. But it also, most importantly, helps them express themselves.